Okay, so the next part we're asked to find the coordinates of B. Okay, now they don't really tell us anything about it, but they don't need to because already they said that we that G was the centroid, and I've just said that the centroid is the intersection of two medians. And a median is from the vertex to the midpoint of the opposite side. So we know that P is a midpoint, and we now know what P is. So we'll go from C to P, and then we'll go from P to B. Okay, so what will we do here in terms of, well, what we have is, let's get our C, which is 4, 2 from the diagram, going on to P, which we found to be 1, 1, 1 minus 1, sorry. And obviously the steps from that, from 4 to 1 is minus 3, and from 2 to minus 1 is also minus 3. Now we we'll start again at P. Okay, so now we know from C to P here. So C to P was minus 3 minus 3. So in units, and we use the exact same units again to go from P to B because we know that P is the midpoint. Okay, so again, starting at 1 minus 1, using the exact same steps, we're going to get that P is 1 minus 3, which is minus 2, sorry, not P, but B this time, and minus 1 minus 3 to be minus 4. So B is minus 2 minus 4. 